Welcome to Mikon's Hardware. Today I have got you details about yet another Chinese X99 motherboard, and this one is Machinist X99 MR9D. The motherboard looks very attractive, and it is also using C612 or X99 chipset. We have a whole heap of PCI Express slots and SATA connections, so it seems to be an interesting option. Unfortunately, this motherboard is absolutely pointless, and I do not recommend buying it. Let's start with the fact that the motherboard is really overpriced and it is not worth the asking 150 euros or so. Then we can proceed with the fact that Machinist X99 MR9D BIOS is really pathetic. And finally, the motherboard has locked BIOS, so there is no option to use FPT tool to read or write BIOS. Moreover, it is also not possible to use external clip to connect to the BIOS chip and to read it or write it because the motherboard schematics is made in that way that you need to desolder the BIOS chip to be able to read it or write it. This is extremely annoying and this also prevents me from testing different BIOS options from Huanangji or other BIOS modification. Still, without FPT we can use AlphaWin to implement Turbo Boost Unlock, even though AlphaWin is reading only half of the BIOS and that's why you are getting 8MB BIOS file instead of 16MB. If you have bought this motherboard, then you still can use Mi 899 to unlock Turbo Boost Unlock using AlphaWin. Even though the motherboard has all of these limitations, I still done some tests, and I have figured out that the motherboard does not support sleep mode, you do not have RAM timings, and even though it is using C612 or X99 chipset, overclocking also doesn't work. One extra problem I found is that PCI Express buffication doesn't work properly, and maybe there are some other issues, because after all of these discoveries, I just abandoned the testing. The motherboard makes absolutely no sense, and I strongly do not recommend buying it. If in the future there will be a better bias for this motherboard, and a simple option to flush this bias without soldering and desoldering the bias chip, I might be making another video about Machinist X99 MR9D. For now though, that's all I can tell about the motherboard, but thanks for watching, thanks for listening, and I hope it helps someone. Bye for now.